The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint John. Jesus said to Nicodemus, Just as Moses lifted up the serpent in the desert, so must the Son of Man be lifted up, so that everyone who believes in him may have eternal life. For God so loved the world that he gave his only Son, so that everyone who believes in him might not perish, but might have eternal life. For God did not send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world might be saved through him. Whoever believes in him will not be condemned, but whoever does not believe has already been condemned, because he has not believed in the name of the only Son of God. And this is the verdict, that the light came into the world, but people preferred darkness to light because their works were evil. For everyone who does wicked things hates the light and does not come toward the light, so that his works might not be exposed. But whoever lives the truth comes to the light, so that his works may be clearly seen as done in God. <clears throat> Sisters and brothers, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Come, Holy Spirit, come, Holy Spirit. Bless this unworthy priest that I may share with humility, with the heart, and that people listen with the Holy Spirit in the hearts. Come, Holy Spirit, come. Sisters and brothers, thank you for the sacrifice and the love in your hearts as you come before God this moment. You notice today we are wearing pink because today is Letare Sunday. Rejoice in the midst of our solemn preparation for Lent. The Lord reminds us to be joyful. There are only two Sundays where, when priests wear the pink vestment. That's today, Leitari Sunday, and Advent Gaudete Sunday. So, what are the two Sundays? Letare and Gaudete Sunday. Letare. May kanta na mga senior. Eh. Seniors, get ready. Letare. Oh, cantare. Oh, oh, oh. Nakalimutan ang lyrics. Nakalimutan. Letare. Sing. To be happy. Lahat tayo may problema, lahat tayo may dinaramdam, may sakit. But the Lord tells us, rise above your problems and just rejoice. The joy of the Lord is my strength. Sabi mo nga sa katabi mo, don't worry, be happy. God loves you. Mama Mary loves you. Alam po nyo, how do we explain letare? Very solemn kasi ang Lent. I'm sure may nagpa-fasting na kayo. It's very good, very good. But, in our penance, continue to be joyful. Maybe we can understand. This is a solemn song. Kinakanta po during funeral masses. And I will raise him up goes like this and I will raise him up 
and I will raise him up, and I will raise him, him up on the last day. Beautiful. It's all about the resurrection. Letare, it goes like this. And I will raise him up, and I will raise him up, and I will raise him, I will raise him, I will raise him up. Happy birthday! <laughs> Ayun, nag-switch. Biglang nag-switch. Maybe that's what Litari Sunday is. You're not just in preparation, penance, and but you do it joyfully. Mga iba kasi di ba yun alam nagfapasting ako? Giti kayo ng giti jan. dapat malungkot tayong lahat. Isko po. The spirit of penance is a joyful spirit. Mga kapatid, why should we be joyful? Because of this one single line in the Bible. John 3.16 For God so loved the world that He sent His only Son that those who believe Him will not perish but have eternal life. Let's say it together. For God so loved the world that He sent His only Son that those who believe Him might not perish but will have eternal life. I'd like you to put that to your heart. Instead of saying the world, say your name. Let's do it now. For God so loved Jerry that he sent his only son that Jerry might not perish but will have eternal life. Pakisabi mo nga sa katabi mo, for God so loved yung pangalan na. For God so loved you, Conrad. Please hold on to this. Listen to this. And you will be okay. Ito po ang kapitan natin. Alam ko, Lord, mahal po niyo ako. Sinabi niya eh, God so loved the world. Ganun na lang pagmamahal. So anytime, you have a problem, alam ko, Lord, mahal niyo ako. You have big sins, alam ko po, mahal niyo ako, Lord. You have sickness, Lord, alam ko po, mahal niyo. That's all. Kapit po tayo kay Lord, mga kapatid. God loves you. Ilan po ang pinangahawakan ko sa buhay ko. And I tell you again, it is better to be presumptuous of God's love than to doubt God's love. Mabuti na lang tanggapin mo na mahal ka pa rin ng Diyos kaysa magduda ka sa pagmamahal ng Diyos. Dalawa pong big time sinner in Jesus' time. The first one was Judas. The second one, big time sinner, Peter. Judas sold Jesus. Pero sabi ni Judas, hindi na ako mahal ng Diyos. So he committed suicide. Peter, mas grabe, he denied Jesus three times. Hindi ko kilala yan. Hindi ko kilala yan. Tinakwil niya eh. Mabigat po. But Peter repented said, Lord, sorry. Alam ko po, mahal pa rin niya ako. Please hold on to God's love. Now, bakit po natin hindi, di tayo we don't hold on to God? Nakakalimutan natin palagi yung John 3.16 na yan. Well, number one, when we pray kasi many times, we talk too much. So what should you do? Mga kapatid, try when you pray, talk less. And listen more. Problema natin, pagharap mo palang kay Lord, higit na, you unload na yung mga problem, i-unload mo na yung mga balak mo, mga project mo. You keep talking. Sisters and brothers, listen to this. Speak, Lord, your servant is listening. 
Every time we come to God, we say that with Samuel. Speak, Lord. Nandito lang po ako. Nakikinig po ako. Ang problema sa atin, hindi tayo nakikinig. We keep talking, we keep thinking, and we are not really listening. Kaya nga ang dami madasalin. Dasal ng dasal. Pareho pa rin ang asal. Ang tapang pa rin, ang sungit pa rin, mayabang pa rin. Nagdadasal naman ako, Father, three times a day, four times. Because you're not really listening to God. Parang minamasinggan mo palagi, Lord. Tatatatatatat. Ceasefire. Tumahimik ka lang dyan. And Lord, nandito lang ako. Ano man gusto niyong sabihin, I am here. Be still and know that I am God. Right now, gulong-gulong isip mo. Oh Lord, ceasefire. I'm just here. Speak, Lord. Your servant is listening. You talk too much. Mayroon ang kwento. Sabi ng husband, you know, sabi ng wife ko, dalawa lang, tatlo lang naman ang fault ko eh. First, my first fault, sabi ng wife ko, sabi niya is, I talk too much. Yo, yung second, I don't listen. And, mayroon pang third, I forgot. Because you talk too much, you don't listen. You forget how much you are loved. Pati po sa mga family, ha? Pakicheck nga natin. Why are you not connecting? Because siguro, mayroon dyan sa family nyo salita ng salita. Speaker of the house. Naka-earphone na lahat mga anak mo, mga apo mo. Ano ba tawag yun? Headphone. And you don't listen. Mag-asawa. That's your problem. Maybe you don't listen enough. You talk too much. And you forget. Mga kapatid, importante po yung for remembering. Don't forget, please. Don't forget. Keep remembering your love. Maala-ala mo pa kaya? Oh, sige na, senior. Tayo kakanta ulit. Maala ala mo kaya ang ay pati nga lyrics hindi na maala ala sige okay na po <laughs> abatid we are servants listen to God relax ka lang all will be well be still and know that I am God listen Right now, may I invite you again to bow your head and listen to the sound of silence. And listen to the Lord telling you, I love you so much. I sent my only begotten Son so that you might not perish and you will have eternal life. Listen to the Lord whisper to you now, Anak, mahal kita. Hindi kita pababayaan. I am always with you. Whatever you sin you commit, I will forgive you. I have forgiven you. And do not worry. Look at the birds in the air. They neither sow nor reap, but the Father takes care of them. You who are sick, I am with you. I will heal you. I am with you always and in always. Listen with your heart. I am with you always. Mga kapatid, please don't forget. Don't ever forget. In those most difficult moments, listen to the Lord telling you, all will be well. Amen and amen. Ang mahirap sa atin, 
ang dali tayong makalimot kay Lord. How easy for us to forget. Oh, seniors, here's another song. Song by Engelbert Humperdinck. The title of the song is Am I That Easy to Forget? Kantayin nga natin. They say you found somebody new But that won't stop my loving you I just can't let you walk away Forget the love I have for you How could I live without regrets? Am I that easy to forget? Ganun ba ka lang kadala, kadali na nakakalimutan mo atin ang Panginoon? O kayong mga mag-asawa dyan, mag magtiginan nga kayo ulit, magtindatan kayo. Don't forget ha. Kiyo kaseyo, ichoporoji maseyo, wasurinay din eh. Hi. Don't forget. Ayun. Go back and capture the moments again. God is speaking. Remember, you are loved. That's all we need to remember, mga kapatid. Mahal tayo ng Panginoon. God so loved you. He gave us His only begotten Son. Please bow your head again and say, Lord, salamat po sa paalaala nyo ngayong Letare Sunday. Pasensya na po, Lord. Pero thank you po. Nandyan lang po kayo. Patawad po sa kayabangan namin. Patawad po, Lord. Ang dami kaming iniisip except you. And yet, you never stop loving us. Salamat po, Lord. Today, will you please give the Lord your smile? Letare naman eh. Letare. Rejoice. Yes, Lord. Maraming salamat po. Amen. Thank you, Mama Mary. Amen. And amen. Let me end with a knock-knock. Knock-knock. Come taft abinyo. I come taft abinyo. Yan ang sinasabi ni Lord. I can't stop loving you. You stop loving me, I will continue pa rin to love you. That's how much God loves us all. Thank you po. Uh, heads up lang po. Uh, we'll be going to Rojas City for a healing mass, March 13. You know, every time we go to a healing mass, that's the only message. You are loved by God. 5.30 p.m. mass at Rojas City. And fast forward, Palm Sunday po. We have finally, after five years, our Palm Sunday recollection. Dati po sa Miralco. This time, it will be in Stancia Commons, Capital Commons Mall. Divine Mercy Chapel, 1.30 p.m. of Palm Sunday, March 24. Anong araw yon? Sunday, right, Palm Sunday. May the peace and the joy of the Lord be with you all. Uh, one more time, spread God's love. Bless me katabi mo. God bless you. Mama Mary loves you. Me too. Pakibless mo nga ulit. God bless you. Pisipilisil yung pisngi. Mama Mary loves you. Me too. Panakpangan natin the Lord for this beautiful moment. Amen. Thank you, Lord.